Hello, this is Zima Soldier bringing you Challenge 24 to capture the case game against a team of pretty weak simulates, despite what the description says. They're all set to easy sim. Now for this challenge I'm going to mostly talk about just the challenge itself because you'll just see me shooting devastators at him and basically one shot him all the time. Now the only problem with the challenge is if they have a devastator or a super dragon. But Devastator is the one you really want to worry about. Because of how large the explosion is, even against easy sims, the explosion will still kill. They'll still be accurate enough to hit you pretty close with the Devastator. Like so. The weapons here on this challenge are CMP, Super Dragon, which are both located by the cases. And then there's Devastator, which you saw me grab at the beginning. Tranquilizers, which are on the bottom parts, you'll never really see them. And then the Golden Magnums, which I will show you in the second half of this video. Now really the best weapon to use is the Golden Magnums, but I just wanted to show using the Devastator you know, how easy it can be. This level is one of those one and done levels. This is the only challenge that you will see it in. And it's basically four even sides they're all the same everywhere around except for on the, the little bottom catwalks where you can fall to your death and even then the bottom parts are only very slightly different the rest of it is nearly identical the cases will always be located where they're showing the video each of the two bases will be located in one of the four bases uh, it will never be different I've never seen the case spawn anywhere other than those four spots. From this death right here, I will try to do something later on in the video that I will explain a little bit better. Right there you see that you know, he has a Devastator and I'm coming up a very, very narrow pathway so I didn't stand a whole lot of chance. So right here I grabbed the Super Dragon. It's a little bit less effective because the explosions are a little bit smaller but you know, once you touch them they're pretty much gone. And with how the auto aim works, you can easily kill them with the rapid fire instead of using the grenade launcher. Now coming up here is the strategy I was talking about, is just make sure that you basically only see his head. Because he can only really shoot at what you can see, and he's going to hit the floor that way. So if you get an easy, cheap line of sight on him, you know, use it. As I say, use your sims, just be cheap against him. You know, there's no human to complain, oh, you know, that's too cheap. You know, screw it. They would cheat you the same if they saw the opportunity. And one thing to note is these sims will actually play the game. You know, they will actually go for your case, albeit rarely. Because you're too busy killing them all the time and they have to restock their weapons. But they will go after the case. So I had to uh, kill him to get my case back on base. That's it. It's challenge 24. And I will show you the much easier way to do it and probably the preferred method because you can get this done in a solid two minutes easily. You know, even with all the spacing between each bases. 
course I spawn in the spot that I don't want to. You, know, you want to go up to the magnums. There are four little bitty platforms outside. And the sim has taken both of my magnums, so I kind of have to wait here for it. And it respawns right now. Because the auto-aim is so sticky with these guys, you can just blow the hell out of them. You see my life right there? It won't change the rest of the video. That's how cheap this is. I will just instantly be one shotting them with magnums. You know, these sims have really terrible accuracy and very bad reaction times. So if you know where they are and they don't really know where you are and they have a grenade launcher, you're going to win. As long as you have a really quick trigger finger. That's all I got to say. And uh, one final note here is this challenge has no time limit. So while all those King of the Hill challenges where you'd be up, you know, five to four and you just say, oh, I'm just going to wait it out. You can't do that on this one. You have to capture the case three times. Uh, I can't tell you how many times I've actually tried to just wait out the timer because I was doing so badly and they all had grenade launchers and, you know, that such scenario. You know, you have to stay aggressive throughout this whole thing or else you will lose. that's it grab whatever weapon you really prefer to grab and kill the sims every chance you get stay aggressive and you'll win